found here a place which was once the royal residence back till 1890. So let's go in and explore this place. Here. That's the residence guide for the Hyunghyunggung Royal Residence. What a wonderful place here. Let's see where this man will lead us. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Oh, I think these are the most beautiful bushes I ever have seen in Korea. Stunning. And these are made with bamboo and avery. Wow. I would love to buy one of these. And what's crazy, these are all hand painted and here you have the insignia of the man or woman who has made them. I have so much love to detail. Also this one here. Wow. Really stunning. So yeah, have an old pagoda with a jumper. <laughs> this one here is funny with the hangyongs, the glasses. So, candles, which are made with the same design. And this watch just costs, she get is a watch, costs $28. Wow. Also, if you look at the pattern when they are closed, all engraved. Really a wonderful exhibition. Especially in summer, these butchers are very, very helpful in Korea and still used by a lot of people. Also, some traditional hats. This one here. Or the king's head from the years. Also, every one of these buildings are rebuilt and the structures made with so much love to detail. My wife has told me that I can choose one of them, so let's see which it will be. They are all wonderful, so it's really hard to choose. This one here. It's so hard to choose one when all of them are so beautiful. Sadly, we could not get one butcher because uh, there was no time left, so sad. But at least we have uh, time to look through Irodang, these royal residences. What a wonderful and calming place here. I went here for the first time in 2019. Wonderful. Also here these old wooden Korean doors. Which really do not fit anymore. The size of modern people. So, you need to be cautious when go freeing that. Look at this here. I think when people think of Asia or for Korea, then this comes in mind. These old houses. Also here, I really wonder how old these stones are. Wow, I think I don't need many words to describe how beautiful this place here is. Especially with the weather today just great.
but I guess these CCTV cameras are not very authentic. Also these twin tenon doors, it's very resistant and well built doors here. And here you can see the house which was built in the 1800s. Let's look one time in one of these buildings that you can see how the people lived here. Sadly we cannot go in the steps here, but I hope to get a glimpse of how these rooms looked like in old Korea. Also, there is a flying kite with which the children have played a lot. So let's see here. I guess we can call this rooms very minimalistic. So here. Minimalistic, but everything has its place. Also, with these desserts, which were, I think, the place where the ladies would sit down back in the days. With all these doors and windows made of these papers, with the same material that the buches made. These are very resistant against water, against damage. So here, something of an old Korean sofa. So here I think this was the old kitchen. Not a lot light, but there are some old tools as you see, some manals. Some Onions and garlic. You have here, maybe this was the closet or an area where you just could throw stuff away which you don't need. Also here, old Korean beddings. These are sold till today. And they're very comfy. It's really so sad that there are now so many people that we cannot get our booches. But too much people are waiting that the man here has hand paint them. So much stuff to decay. So. Yobegimana, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
and I'm very happy that both countries today are not so hostile to each other because this was really a shame back in the days. Especially colonialism is such a bad thing. Here one of the first concepts of the Korean flag which should not been used for another 50 years. When Korea finally earned their independence. But also when we talk about the royal family in Korea, if you look back then, these buildings here were very beautiful, but the royal family lived very good in Korea. You had these beautiful buildings here, you had many luxury as you saw also in these rooms, but the common people in Korea, if you were not a young man in Korea, which was a nobleman or a royal, you could not live like that. You lived very bad as a common guy, a common man, a common woman in Korea back then. And the people had such a hard life, while the royal family had it so good. And it's really beautiful that today all people here in Korea can have a good life if they want to work hard. That's why I think monarchy was never really a good thing. So, now let's go out again 200 years in the future to modern Seoul and to Bukchong Hanung Maul, which is right in this direction. <laughs>